Welcome to Wago Guides. In this guide, I'll explain how you can quickly turn off notifications on your Android phone. Let's get straight into it. I'm on my Android phone and I'm on my home page with a view of my apps. It's quick to turn off app notifications on your Android phone, but it can be tricky to do if you've not tried it before. In this guide, I'll show you how to do that in five simple steps. I know that sounds like a lot, but I promise you we'll be done in less than two minutes. In order to turn off any notifications you receive in your phone, either temporarily or permanently, you need to open the settings app. This is shown on screen, but if you can't see it on your phone, you can quickly find it by using the search bar at the bottom of the page. I'll tap on the app once to open it. You'll see on the app home screen, there are a large number of options displayed, but we're interested in the notifications section. I'll tap on that option once to open it. We're now in the notifications management area of your phone. This is quite a complex area of settings, so there's a lot going on in this page. But we're looking for one specific section. If I scroll down the page a little, we eventually get to a general area of the page. Within this, there's a do not disturb option, which you can use to manage how and when notifications are displayed on your phone. So I'll tap on this section to open it up. I want to dive further into this area. At the moment, the top of the page tells us that the Do Not Disturb feature isn't active. What this means is that notifications will continue to be received. To change that and stop receiving notifications, I'll tap once on the Turn On Now button. A pop-up message appears that provides a number of options on how you can turn off notifications. By default, the option to turn off until you choose to turn it back on is selected. You can, however, choose to stop notifications for a specific period of time or until a later time that is suggested by the settings app. I'm happy with the option that's selected, so to confirm that, I'll tap on the turn on button in that message. The top of the page now tells us that do not disturb is active. This means that we'll only be notified of any messages or calls we receive from people we've marked as important or any notifications from priority apps we've identified. I hope you found this Woggle guide useful and learned something new. If you have, please like this video or subscribe for free so that you can find out when new guides are available. Thanks for watching and do look after yourself until next time.